Well, isn't it? What are we doing, Carol? I'm just going to ink up my piece of card. There's nothing on it this time. Now, if you actually did a picture and you hated yep. it, you can just do this on top. It's oh. not a problem, all right? So now I'm going to just cover it with powder. Okay. And then heat that. Now let me give you the details of the precious, there we go, there they are. You've got metallic bronze, you've got metallic copper, lapis lazuli, that beautiful blue. You also have, of course, jasper, cloisonne, that's my favourite, the cloisonne, and the garnet there. And I've just put them together in two groups of three, but you can mix whatever you want. So you can make whichever colours you want yes. to do. What ones are you doing today then? Uh, the, well, first one I'm using... The, the bronze? Yep, those okay, three. Okay, there we go. So we've got the lapis, the copper and the bronze that we're going to use. So we've done two. This is our second layer. Yes. And the benefit, that's the amazing glaze there, 912469 at £10. But the benefit of using this heat it gun is the fact that it's not blowing away that amazing glaze, which actually would be totally pointless, wouldn't oh, it? Oh, you end up wearing it. <laughs> We don't want to be doing that. Right. Now, I love that bumpy sort of effect this, there. This, again, is very hot. Right, so be I'm careful. I'm just going to sprinkle a bit of that one. This is why I need three trays. Now, this is your... Oh, look at this. Now, we turn, turn it, it round. round. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going to... Now, it doesn't matter if it cools down, because you... You can warm it up I'm again, going to go back. You? I okay. should go back. Now, why do we go back, then? Uh, if it's not quite where you want the colour. Right. You want to add a bit more of one of the colours. And then do you put the glaze again on top? No. All oh, right. So you use the gun to melt it sort of yes. into it. Yeah. So the glaze is just to give you the thickness. Right. And then the uh, powders to give you the colour. Oh, that is just that lovely. Now, when you see this, it looks so simple, doesn't it? And it is simple to do, but the benefit of it, the end result looks so classy and so expensive. That's what I love about it. But more than that, it really looks like you have taken the time and the effort to, to make something. And people are going to look at that and think, where did they get all these from? And that, that's what that's I find. Yeah. Do you find that? How yes. did you do that? Where did you get it from? <laughs> and it can be our little secret. But, but share it. It's Stamp Addicts. Now, and what have we got here? It's then? hot, right? But you don't want to rush, and you need some ink on your stamp to help release it from the hot surface. Just pop that down. Okay, now I'm sure you've got inks at home, and if not, we have got the stays on. Now, but what, yeah, go on. If oh, you're look. a bit slow, I mean, because I was waiting for you yes. there, but you can see it's not so impressed. It's not a problem. We just give it some more heat and press into it again. Right. So okay. anything you don't like, you don't throw away. Well, actually, that is a really good, that, that you is can, good to show you You can part heat as well, and you can have... Like the image half softened. Oh, look at this. Look, look, it's completely melting because I was gassing too much and not <laughs> sinking. Okay, so you get the you get the ink again. Yeah. Okay. And then press in. And if you want it deeper, you just add another layer of the clear before you oh, look do at the rest. That. that looks gorgeous. Nice. And that Peel is how off. easy it is to do. That's it. And look, let's show you. I'm going to hold that up for you so that you can see exactly what it looks like there we go now there you can look I mean it really is incredible look at the beautiful colors the metallics there the bronzes the coppers and that wonderful lapis lazuli giving you the little kick there almost like a verdigris feel 912470 is your item number we've got our little foam can I stick that shall I stick that yes, on? Do you want yes yes no on? that's fine okay just let's just show you that while you're <laughs> getting that there I'll put my powders away because I'm going to use different powders. Okay, now this is where those snappy trays really come in handy, isn't it? Because you don't mm. waste anything. No. And if you don't want to waste anything, 490, 913712, 490 each. Go for half a dozen of them, especially if you're going for the embossing powders, because you can see how... Look, there we go. There's two cards, one that we've done and one that was done already earlier. And they are brilliant, aren't they? And so easy to do. Now, if you're thinking, well, I've got to make half a dozen of those, you do them all at the same time, can't you? Oh, yes. And yes. then then make the cards, after. Okay, so let's put that back there. What are we doing now? Um, I'm just going to do uh, the, the other card. One. Yes. Okay, let's show using you. Using the other. Using the artifact stamp. Let's pop those. Let's give you the details of that artifact stamp because they're going to come up on your screen there. That's 912467 at just £12.90p. Now, what are we going to do then? Oh, yeah, this one. Let's show you let's because see. what you'll notice now, this is a really thick one. Is this three layers on this one? Um, it might be. Um, it just varies sometimes. But look at that. Now, I'm fascinated with Egyptology, so that to me is just beautiful. I love it. I love the fact that you've got 
It's got a real waxy feel, hasn't it? It's almost like a wax seal. Yes, now, you're using nice. the Amazing Glaze. Now, let's have a look. The Amazing Glaze, don't forget, it comes in three parts. You're getting your cards, you're getting the Amazing Glaze, and that's your embossing ink, isn't it? That's right. Okay. To stick to. I'm just going to cover that and give it a little melt. Whiz, a little melt with our heat gun, and the benefits of that. As you notice, it's not actually bur sort of blowing that everywhere. And, of course, that's why if people are thinking, well, I can use regular hair dry, you can't, can you? It's very different. It's not hot enough. Right. It just it's... doesn't have the heat. And this one, obviously, you don't use on your hair. Okay, so there <laughs> you can see. Look at yeah. this. It's literally just it's melting that down. So it goes all bubbly. Yeah. And if you like that effect, you can keep that, can't you? You can, yes. The hammered look. The hammered look. I like that. <laughs> okay. And look, watch, this is how easy it is to do. And you can be doing this. The lovely thing about stamp addicts, I really do feel that they bring all these innovative, imaginative ideas into your home. You don't have to pay a fortune. You don't go and have to take a course. We're bringing the products from stamp addicts to your front door so that you can actually make and create the most magical, magical things. And that's why we absolutely adore it when Carol comes here, to create and, and craft with Ideal World, because we're getting ideas that we don't all we see and I think that these are fabulous what we do in there I'm doing three layers this okay. time and then we're going to do different colors oh you're using my closet name Jasper <laughs> so as I said it's like hot jam yep. so you do have to be, be careful. careful just transfer the heat and then sprinkle some color oh look at this and it doesn't matter again as we were talking about if you miss a little bit because what you can do is just literally warm go it up back. again and go back oh that's gorgeous And, so, and it doesn't take very long, does it? That's no. what I love about it. Because I'm a little bit impatient. Oh, so am I. I like it, I like it now. I don't <laughs> want it next week. And that's what I love about these beautiful colours. And look, watch now, because Carol's going to do a little bit of a sprinkling. Just a, on the white corners. Okay. That's all you need there, isn't it? Mm. And then while it's still warm, that's when you do the stamping, isn't it? Yes. Now, if you rush and press into it, and it sticks to your stamp, it's not a problem. Melt it Once down. it's cold, you peel it off ah. and do it again. So as I said, you don't throw any of this away. Now watch this, look. Press in. There you I go. Mean, look at this. And do you know what? You would never, I would never have thought of using stamps to create such magical effects as we have done, or Carol has done here. Let me show you, because there's the little card. Now, don't forget, the card comes with the embossing ink and the amazing glaze there, with the amazing glaze. Now, those are your precious colours embossing powders, 91247 at 1490, which we've used here. But let's give you the details of the amazing glaze, 912469. Isn't that gorgeous? And I love the fact you've got the gold background. Is that because you oh. use the gold stamp? Yes. Yes. Right. Okay. I'm just going to wipe it. should be cool now. You can just wipe a pad on the edge. Ooh. Or you can emboss the edge. But look at all this. Well. These are handy tips, aren't they? Because <laughs> see, I wouldn't have thought of that. I'd have just stuck it on. Yeah. There you go. And look Done. at that. Now, there you can see. Let me show you because that is absolutely stunning.